Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So I have my first scribbler box. The March scribbler box has arrived and I am so excited. This is my first scribbler box that I have ordered. It is the one year anniversary box. So it was promised that it will be amazing. And so I decided to order it and give it a try because I feel like everyone needs this in their lives. <laughs> Let's hop right into this and open it up. I'm so excited to see what is in here. All right. Uh, I can tell you that I'm already in love with the first thing that I just saw in this box. But I'm not going to pull it out yet. Little card. Oh, it's a little thank you note. For allowing us to have Scribbler in our lives and embracing it over the last year, which I can't say that I have since this is my first box. But these I'm in love with. I love socks like crazy. So this is so perfect for me. Look at these socks with typewriters on them. I love them. Those are so cute. I'm almost afraid to wear them. My stinky feet. Oh, and look at all this fun stuff. All right, and then we have night notes, a little notebook. Oh, this is awesome. It's on recycled paper. Look at this. Look at that. I love recycled paper. It's so soft to write on and so amazing. This is eco-responsible. So a little notepad for little notes for when you're falling asleep or waking up from your dreams, which is when I always have the best ideas, is when I'm waking up from my dreams. All right, so this is Writer Magic Inside. Oh, I think this is the invitation that they send out. Yes, it is. You're invited to see Liz Peltier. Ooh. So it's a live chat with her. She sounds amazing. So that. How fun. And then the writing passport. I'm so excited about this. I see these on every unboxing and they look amazing. And I'm super, super excited. It looks like it's written we got a career highlight for Rebecca Yaros. And she's got a little thing in here for writing relationships. I love this. This is an awesome quote in here. The bottom line in writing realistic emotional connections is remembering that relationships and the human need to be understood by one another are as universal as they are unique. For Rebecca Yaros. I can't wait to read this. I feel like that'll help me a lot. Oh yes! I was actually just thinking that I needed one of these. And this one's even better than one I would have picked for myself. It says writer on it. Little pencil pouch. This is awesome. This is perfect. I was seriously thinking about finding one for my journaling. Now I don't need to because I got one out of my box. Oh, what's this? <clears throat> Publishing process inside look. Oh, cool. So it looks like it's a timeline and character interviews from um, Rebecca Yarrow's. Yeah. It's a look inside of Rebecca Yarrow's notebook she kept while drafting the last letter. That's awesome. Ooh, I can't wait to look at all of this and like, really study it. This is fantastic. And then it has like a little list of everything that's in the box. And April's theme is voice. And I heard that they've been working on this bo box a lot. So I may actually continue my subscription and get that next month as well. And here's the book of the month.
Rebecca Yarrow's The Last Letter. This looks really good. I have a lot of books on my TBR, but I think I might have to drop them back and read this one. This looks awesome. Ooh, I love the cover. It's so pretty. And then there's a bookmark. And then an autograph book plate for me to put in my book. And then there is... Let's see if I can get it out of here. Some wall art. Read a thousand books and your words will flow like a river by Lisa C. That's awesome. I love that. I'm definitely going to put that up on my writing desk. So that is the March 2018 Scribbler Box. It's like my favorite thing I've gotten in the mail all month long. And I love this box. I'm going to save it and I'm going to use it for treasures. What kind of treasures? Probably junk journaling treasures, but it is so nice. It looks so nice. I'm super, super excited about this. Victoria and Lindsay, you definitely outdid yourself with this box. And I'm really looking forward to getting another one. So if you would like to subscribe to a Scribbler box, I will leave the link in the description box below. You can go check it out. And then I also had some news that I keep forgetting to share. And that is that I was featured by an online magazine as one of the top influencers of 2018. I will leave the link to that below as well if you'd like to check it out. And I also received a book review for Scraps of Love if you'd like to check that out. It's also down below. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Thank you for dropping by and I'll see you next time.